<laughs> welcome, welcome. This is still whiskey. I like whiskey. You like whiskey. Yeah. They like yeah. whiskey. Mm -hmm. But not all whiskey's good whiskey, if we're honest. Right. right? Yeah. Mm. But it's still whiskey. It's true. My name's Rich. I'm Vince. I'm Devin. And today we are going to try some Jack Daniels single barrel, barrel proof rye. That's Boom. It's a mouthful. It is a lot. You got it. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's go. Right. So you listen, my experience of, of Jack Daniels, honestly, I, I resisted. I resisted it for a long time. Maybe. Can you not, do you need some help? Yeah. Do you need, do you need a little bit, <laughs> a little bit of help? I resisted it for a long time because I'm like, Jack, I had a bad experience. I had maybe too many bad experiences when I was younger. Yeah. Of Jack black label Jack Ugh. Daniels. And it wasn't until... I think that's how all of us started with <laughs> whiskey, But it right? wasn't, and, and the same holds true for Jim Beam too. Can you just get rid of your situation? I'm hiding it. So, so, <laughs> okay. but, but I didn't like it. I didn't Ooh. like it. Spicy, I like it. So, but I didn't like Jack Daniels until the gold label single barrel barrel proof Tennessee whiskey. And then that was a game changer. That was a total game changer. I'm like, shoot, did I just become like a Jack Daniels fan? Yeah. yeah. Did I just like that? Yeah. And then all of a sudden I'm like, you were like, this is it's a pretty heavy banana, yeah. but shoot, I really like this high proof. Yeah. I was like, oh, wow, we're having a good time. We're having a good time. All right. Mm -hmm. I mean, I feel like I got gypped a little bit. <laughs> Did you? You, you, <laughs> you got hosed. Well, you were the first floor, like, I was a little bit. But with this bottle, I've been excited to look at this and taste this for quite some yeah. time. Well, and that's the thing too, right? Like it was a <clears throat> special release right. prior to this. Like it's not just so recently that they right. actually started right, 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 doing right, right, a national right. well, distribution of it. But this is not going national permanent part yep. of the lineup, which yep. I personally at what sixty five dollars. Yeah, I am personally confident. So, so what like you're I, so what you're saying is that they weren't making a high end whiskey until I just didn't. I just thought they that this is the only one that I knew of was the black label. But did they not ever make a better? They had this end. as a special release. Yeah, okay. for the rye release, specifically. Yeah, yeah the rye specifically. So, you know, we always had the barrel proof uh, right. of the bourbon, but yeah. getting the rye, yeah. Mm. But look at the color, right? Like, I mean, oh my gosh. it's a- uh, Very dark. Yeah. I mean, the mash bill on this, you know, it's 70% rye, 18% corn, and 12% malted barley. Um, I, am, I am into what is happening right here. I'm into it. It's funny, cause you get the Jack Daniels, like the mm -hmm. barrel proof smell, mm -hmm. the bourbon smell, but, you know what it reminds me of is um, spices on top. It reminds me of um, raisin bran. I like the cereal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I get that. Raisin comes through pretty good. I don't but, smell but much like, of the rye. That like that's a crazy. Maybe it's because no, it's high proof. I it's guess not. We didn't talk about like it is 136.1 proof. So like you are getting a lot of that ethanol smell. Right. You know, mm -hmm. but right. you pull it back a little bit and. Oh, what was that so song? Good. I heard it for the grapevine. Remember that? The, the, I'm excited to hear where you're going with this. The Raisin Bran commercial. I heard from you. Know, okay, anyway. I don't wow. think that was the Raisin Bran commercial. That, yes, that it was. was. You are making stuff up. Really? You are definitely lying. The funny right thing right. is, is you're not the oldest one here and you're bringing back <laughs> things that... That's what I'm telling you. When I smelt this, okay. it was like I was like finishing my last scoop of Raisin mm. Bran. That's what happened to me. Okay, so I do get the bready, the more bready note. Oh. Oh my gosh. Really? I am not mad about this at all. Ooh. The fact that I'm gonna be able Ooh, to- Ooh, there's this, a lot going on there. I <laughs> I like this. That's a lot happening. I get like a- How hot is this? It doesn't seem that hot. No. I mean, it definitely is the hottest rye I think I've had. Is that true? 136 proof? I don't know if that's true. I mean, like, I feel like my, the closest thing the we have to that from is like, what, Stag Junior or like the right, Old Forester right. or like, like I just, like for a rye. Ooh, at the end though, that's when it just right. coats yeah. your whole it's You definitely get the, the heat. heat of the ethanol yeah. right away, but like you let yeah. that sit for a minute. It just coats your whole mouth though. Yeah. You feel like sticky caramel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but I get like a cinnamon raisin toast. Mm. Yeah. Like have like buried in butter. Yes. Cinnamon raisin toast mm -hmm. that I won't let my kids have because I want it and I'm selfish. Right. That's what I'm getting. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm getting right there. This is fantastic. Yeah, definitely uh, like. I could crush this. Not this only worth the wait, mm -hmm. right? Because it's, I mean, how long we've been <clears throat> looking for, I mean, searching for whiskeys. Like, but, well, this has been at the. Well, for the special release one. Yeah, this has been at the beginning. It. Like, we knew, like, this was one yep. to try yeah. to get. Yeah. And 
you know, I've never had the special release, so I don't know how this compares to the special release itself, but I don't care, this is good. It's like, really good. And if this is something that we can start getting more often, I think, you know, we we stopped seeing, at least here where we are locally, we stopped yeah. seeing a lot of the barrel proof right. yeah. uh, bourbons, the single barrel bourbon, because of the glass shortage. Like I heard that they didn't yeah. change their glass yeah. and all that. So yeah. hopefully we start seeing those come back here. Yeah. Hopefully if, this starts coming in. If this is on a, all right, so at <clears> 65, <throat> I think mm -hmm. I paid 70 with tax, whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. If That's this great. is on our shelf. I mm -hmm. will buy it every time. If it's on your shelf. Yeah. At 65, 70 dollars. Yeah. This is a no, Brainer, and I haven't even finished. I, I think I would buy it for eighty if I had to. I mean, without, without really for something like this, I probably yeah, I would. Personally, I'd I go, would. I'd go up to a hundred probably. Wow. Mm. For, it would be for a rye like this, right? Like we we have tons of high proof bourbons, we have True. tons of that, but like well, you're always gonna have it. If yeah. it's that much money, you're gonna have a bottle. And with a high proof, just... like I'm not I'm not like tearing through this. Right. Exactly. Right. Like right. I'm, it's gonna last. I That's feel true. like the 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 heat kind of persists, but it's it's heavier on the on the nose. Yeah. Right, than it is on the palate or on I the agree. finish. On the palate and finish, I'm like, oh, I can tell it's proofy, but I'm not like. You really don't feel, taste the heat as much as you feel it. Right. Like it warms yeah. you up and it makes you me want to have a cigar. We should have a cigar. I'm down for a cigar. I personally, you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking mm. winter. Like mm. winter time. Yeah. Fire's lit, to your yep, right? Yep. Um, and this is a, a winter warmer. Yeah. Like, this is beautiful. I mean, the high proof definitely is the warming piece, but like rice, should be a rice, drink. rice have always, like, especially like these, uh, like rice spicy <clears throat> yeah. style of the rice have always been more the winter drink. So like midwinter's night drink, sure. right? Like, sure. yeah. you know, you get the, like, it just, it reminds you of Christmas. Um, yeah. yeah. But yeah, the heat, like summertime, you know, we're getting into it's, summer, like it's gonna like, you, You're not gonna want to be in a hot tub. I'm not this. saying we're doing ice cubes, but like it could, it would hold it up would, well. It would, it would hold, hold up, up well with to an ice cube. cube. If you were an ice cube guy, then we should have brought ice cubes. We should have. Wash your mouth. Mm -hmm. I'm not into it. Listen. <laughs> but to cool it down, to make it so, a summer drink, I think you could do that. Like, I, I mean, I've done that on some of the high proofs, sit outside on the porch, like that's an easy thing. This is not as heavy bananas as, mm -hmm. as what is a typical. Yeah. And, but, and keep in mind, this is a single barrel. So yeah. every bottle, is gonna be slightly different. Every right, barrel is gonna be slightly right, different. Right, right. So yours could even be, in theory, hotter than 136.1, which is the bottle we have. <clears throat> could be also a little bit lower. I think they start at 125 or something like that. Yeah. But but for the money, I think it's a no-brainer. It doesn't carry the bananas as thick. A um, little bit of mint on the back end. It's very complex. There is a lot happening in this. You know, like what? there is a lot going on. I wanna. I'm wondering if the the bourbon is the banana piece. Let's grab the. Oh, interesting. Let's get the we can do it. barrel proof here. Wow. Devin's, Devin's going for it. Which you do not have an open one over here. All right, looks like we're opening another bottle. <laughs> do you have another open one? Okay, perfect. I have, I don't have that. I have the Hero Select. I don't have an open one because I crushed my other one. Because I, I should have brought, I, I should have brought the Hero Select because Which is funny could have done that for, for, the, for a, for a we have the non- okay. Jack Daniels drinking person yeah. that I crush this stuff. Yeah, my typical, wife knows this is like one of my favorite. The stuff. the typical Jack Daniels, right? Yes. Like even yes. the what the black label, the single barrel select right. isn't a bad one. No, I like it. Like I like the high proof. Sure, it's the you have the it right over but there. This on the is shelf, this but. is what what put me across the line. This, yeah, this bottle right here. Put and me then we couldn't get it for the longest time. Couldn't get it forever, and. No, I love it. I'm all about it. I'm so, I can't believe this is only sixty five. I can't believe he can't open a bottle of whiskey. I don't know what you're doing. Do you need your knife? Do you need? You need. I mean, I got. I can pull the cork, but yeah. Wow. I'm gonna, it's hot what in here. What are you? What are you doing? Between this bird, this rye, and <laughs> yeah. this room. Don't catch this room. This room. That would is. be awkward. <laughs> but I get. But I get exciting. this like butterscotch on the finish. I get heat persisting throughout. Yeah. Rich. Intense, but not overbearing. Like I'm not like shoot. Yeah, I agree. But it's intense and it's oh, like you said, complex. It's thoughtfully complex. This is it, gonna be really it, interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, so obviously it's not gonna be um, like apples, apples, or whatever because of the bourbon. Bananas and bananas. Bananas, and bananas. Yeah, you know. Bananas in bananas. Christmas to summer, whatever you want to do. I was gonna say this would be if if y'all want to get me this for my for <laughs> my birthday, which is in November, or for Christmas, I would be I would accept it. I, I would accept it. Don't think I'm getting you a Christmas present. Wow, this is uh, a lot less. You poured a lot. It less is a lot time. less. What proof is this one? 
Uh, this one's sitting at 134, so okay. a little bit lower proof. Okay. We do not plan to uh, do a side by side, but here we, we did are. not. Here we are. Here yeah, we are. Thank you, Devin. You went off the nose. I mean, I'm pretty sure I brought you back a bottle from my last trip of this. I don't know what you're talking about. He drank it. That all. sounds like fake news. <laughs> See on the palate, that taste, that that the heat comes through hotter there. Or is that just me? Um, yeah, I don't know that I would say that. Mm. It doesn't taste. Oh. oh my gosh, that rye is so good. So I do get a lot more of the bananas on this one. Right. And it's the rye that kind of sticks over the top of it. Mm -hmm. This is also a lot simpler. There's not as much happening. This this one is very good, but it's, don't you think this one's got a much more complex. Oh yeah, for sure, sure, much more complex. I mean, yeah. I think, like I said, like you don't see many high proof ryes like this. Also the yeah. finish just lasts. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. telling you, if you see this, for this, sure. is, this is a must buy. Yeah, I'd going? go up to 100, but I mean, if you're an 80 or under, 80 or under is an easy buy. 100%. 80 under is a very yeah. easy buy. And if you could get it for $65, buy two. Yeah, because when we're or seeing three. when we're seeing like if, blue when if, we're seeing blue runs and all that sure, going sure. for 80, like right. yeah, I would take like. But if I could get this for 65 consistently, yeah, it would buy. I would buy it every time. I'd buy it every time. I mean, we knew that with this one. We knew that with this one already. Like this for a high proof. Like I just have a bourbon. lot of those. Yeah, but yes, yeah. Hmm. Are we gonna rate it? Yeah, so. All right, what's your grade? <clears throat> what is your grade? Oh my gosh, that's good. It's so good. I mean, for me. Like a tobacco in the end? Mm -hmm. Right, like yeah. right on the very back? Yep. Like a tobacco? Yep, exactly. What are we rating out of? I forgot. Are we doing one to 10? Are we doing S to One to 10. S S to <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> one to 10? One to 10? I mean, this is definitely. And keep in mind the price point, right? Yeah. You can't, yeah. Like you can't go. Yeah. Oh well, I yeah. think such and such is better. At that money for sixty-five, if it if it's sixty-five dollars every day, all day, I mean, this is an easy. Because I haven't had everything, I'm gonna give a little bit of room. I'm gonna say it's a nine. Like I don't, I I don't know what a ten is, right? I haven't had a WLW. I haven't had some of these others, sure. like right, you know, where at those price points, if you get those at retail, obviously you're not going to be able to get those most of the time at retail. But you get those at retail, like so. I'm going to give myself a little well, room. Well, but, say but I'm don't, go nine. Okay, you don't want to you don't want to put it in the bucket of like available sixty five dollar bottles. I guess it's not really available, is it? It's not here. Yeah, not, here. not yet. I'd say so. That's I'm going to go with nine for me. Like that's it's just a it's a great tasting one that. Um, yeah, I'd buy all day if I saw it on the shelf. That really is fabulous. And it's 136. Mm -hmm. That like, I keep on my brain, I keep on being like, oh, it's almost as, like it's similar to, and then it's like 115 proof bottle yeah. or something. Right, 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 right. <clears throat> it's easy to drink. Mm -hmm. What's your rating? I'm gonna give it a nine and a half. Oh, mm -hmm. oh. If it was a 115 proof, I might give it a nine. I mean, if it was, it 100, like if it was 115 proof, it tastes like you got so many other bottles there. Like for me, like that would drop it down to probably like an eight, mm -hmm. seven and a half or eight. Like it's still good, but like you're, I think we're getting so much of the high proof because of just the complexity that's coming out of the barrel. I'm yeah. calling it a no brainer nine. Yeah. yeah. Which means at, at not, if you drink it and you don't think it's a nine, you're crazy. Yeah. Agreed. I think it's a no brainer nine. Or yeah, you just can't right. handle your proof. Right. That's also possible. Yeah. Then put some ice in it and then you'll love it. No. I mean, I'm just saying. Just start level with, up. Start, start with drops of water. <laughs> start with little drops <laughs> no, of water. No, yeah, no, yeah, no. yeah, yeah, yeah. Just level up as a person. So we're not all Irishmen. We don't <laughs> haven't had this where we've been <laughs> drinking since we've been five. Wow. You know. Oh, wow. We're stereotyping yeah. our faces off. I yes. mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure I've heard stories. <laughs> we don't talk about it. <laughs> but, you know, if you need to prove it down. That's a joke, but I am not going to. Yeah, if you need to prove it down. Becoming a better person. A few drops of water. Yeah, and it, find, taste it, try it if you need a little more. Like you, you can control how you bring one of these down. But whatever you do, buy it. Yeah, for sure. If you see this at the store, you need to buy Definitely. it. Definitely. That heat so. on the back end with yeah. the, the mint and the tobacco, mm -hmm. a little bit of butterscotch. Oh, so good. I would be, I would love to, to taste another barrel. Just to compare see. them, mm -hmm. yeah. do like a side by side. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, can't right. do that. So, <laughs> sounds like we're all a buy it. Yeah. Oh, it's, easy all, buy. it's, it's yeah. an easy buy. Yeah, for it's sure. It's an easy buy. It's a great value. Yeah. Well, anyway, this is still whiskey. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll we'll see you next time.